Patrick uh, has decided not to do his performance tonight, but Patrick, another time, yes? Hello. Can you, Can you hear me now? Can you hear me? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, well, I was just saying that uh, after uh, uh, maybe we'll see this performance another time. Yeah, basically what I was going to do was I was doing a piece on a stoner, which is uh, I think everybody there probably knows who who it is or who they are, and uh, I, over the years I've got very angry with regards of their existence, and um, the performance piece was going to be based on the fact that. Uh, 250 people have decided to be very elitist and receive half of them are receiving 17,000 nearly 17,500 euro every year as long as they don't earn more than 24,000 euro per year so the piece was basically going to be about that and the fact that uh, Visual Arts Ireland have got 1,500 members who've got to survive as artists on their own and um, the fact that Charles Hawhey and uh, Mr Cronin back in 1981 set up this very elite group and in, I just think it's so wrong. They meet once a year what? and that's about it. Okay Patrick, <laughs> yeah, I understand where you're coming from and uh, so I that's, that, as that's I said earlier, you know, artists aren't being paid, period. Also, mm -hmm. artists aren't being paid enough, enough, period. And we have seen it through this pandemic. We've seen how artists are struggling uh, to uh, make ends meet. And, uh, yeah. you know, handouts, artists are not looking for handouts. Artists work and artists work hard. And they, artists want to be remuner remunerated to or the quality of work they've done. Where would the public be without the arts at at this time in this pandemic? The arts have stepped up and they have entertained and they have enlightened and they have um, created situations to help uh, people through this uh, uh, a difficult time. So I see where you're coming from, Patrick. But it's nice. It's nice for you and I to have done so many art cabarets over the years. Yeah, and we will we will continue to strive and to do and to make that point and to give uh, the the many. It's like I I I can't think of the amount of people that have performed at the arts cabarets who have gone on to other yeah. situations and that sort of thing or to do to, to be involved in the arts in any, in other ways it's just uh, it's just uh, for me that's the most pleasing thing about the arts cabaret is in giving somebody that opportunity to be able to have the confidence to go ahead and do whatever anyway we, we could talk about this till the cows come home. So let's go 